everyone. Today we are going to sing Open Shut Them. Right, put up your hands. Let's go. Open shut them, open shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open shut them, open shut them. Put them in your lap, lap, lap. Creep and crawl them, creep and crawl them. Right up to your chin, chin, chin. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Do not put them in, in, in. Very good. Right, today's story is called The Three Billy Good Gruff. So sit back and enjoy the story with me. Once upon a time, there were three billy goat gruffs. There was a little billy goat, a middle-sized billy goat, and a big billy goat gruff. The three billy goat gruffs lived in a field, and they spent their days munching on the green grass. On one side of the field, there was a stream. And over the stream, there was a rickety bridge. On the other side of the rickety bridge, there was a hill. And there, the grass grew greener and sweeter than it did in the field of the billy goat gruff. Under the rickety bridge, there lived a hairy troll in a deep, dark hole. It was dark and damp under the bridge and that made the troll furious. He was also very hungry. One day, the little billy goat Gruff looked up and saw the grass up on the hill on the other side of the stream. It looked very green and sweet. I think I'll move over there for my next course, he said. Then I'll grow big and that. So, trip trap, trip trap went the hooves of the little billy goat gruff as he started to cross the rickety bridge. The big hairy troll woke up with a start. Who's that crossing my bridge? he said. I am, said the little billy goat gruff. I'm crossing the bridge to eat the grass on the other side of the stream. Oh, no, you're not, said the big hairy troll, and he sang. I am a troll from the deep, dark hole. My belly's getting thinner. I need to eat and go to treat, so I'll have you for my dinner. Oh, don't do that, said the little billy goat gruff. I'm only small. Wait for my brother, he's much bigger. And he skipped over the rickety bridge to the other side. Just then the middle-sized billy goat gruff looked up and he too saw that the grass on the other side of the stream looked very green and sweet. I think I'll move over there for my next course, he said. Then I'll grow bigger and fatter. So, trip, trap, trip, trap went the hooves of the middle-sized billy goat gruff as he started to cross the rickety bridge. Who's that crossing my bridge? roared the big hairy troll. I am, said the middle-sized billy goat gruff. I'm crossing the bridge to eat the grass on the other side of the stream. Oh, no, you're not said the big hairy troll, and he sang. I'm a troll from the deep dark hole. My belly's getting thinner. I need to eat and go to treat. I'll have you for my dinner. Oh, don't do that, said the little middle-sized billy goat gruff. I'm not very big. I wouldn't make much of a mouthful. Wait for my brother. He's much bigger. And he skipped 
walked over the rickety bridge to the other side. Just then, the big billy goat gruff looked up and he too saw the grass on the other side of the stream look very green and sweet. I think I'll move over there for my next course, he said. Then I'll grow bigger and fatter. So, trip, trap, trip, trap, went the hooves of the big billy goat gruff as he started to cross the rickety bridge. Who's that crossing my bridge? roared the big hairy troll. I am, said the big billy goat gruff. I'm crossing the bridge to eat the grass on the other side of the stream. Oh no, you're not, said the big hairy troll, and he sang. I'm the troll from the deep dark hole. My belly's getting thinner. I need to eat goats a treat. So I'll have you for my dinner. The big billy goat gruff stopped. His knees shook. His hooves trembled. Clickety clack, clickety clack on the rickety bridge. Then he pulled himself together. I don't think you will, he said. And he picked up his hooves and kicked the troll into the middle of next week. Then the billy goat gruff skipped over the rickety bridge to join his brothers and sisters on the other side of the hill. As for the big hairy troll, I'm happy to say that he was never seen again. Well, I hope you enjoyed that story. Look forward to seeing you soon. Bye for now.